Hello everyone, it's me, JSKB, and welcome to Rot. It's an indie horror game that I got off of the front page of Itch.io, not the front page, but like the popular horror games in Itch.io, and it's been a while since I played one of those, so we're gonna play this one real quick, okay? How's it hitting my PC? It's on ultra settings, and I'm afraid of ultra settings, because I have a good PC, but the shit still, it's crazy. I don't know, it's crazy. I can't go that way, as account, on account of invisible walls. Oh my god, I'm so short. I'm only like three steps, four steps tall. Whatever. Okay, oh, never mind. Maybe it's just a tiny world. Hello? Hello? Okay, it's, it's supposed to be like a- Oof, God, this feels weird. My eye- Whoa, what the- What's going on? Oh! Home! Okay, what- What is happening? Why- I'm just clicking, trying to be curious and shit. Oh, it's a note. Dear Justin, 1st November 2018. My time at home has been good. Grandma has been staying with us in the spare room and her cooking has been a boom to us all. She made us all a wonderful roast dinner last Sunday and I get a nostalgic thinking about it. <laughs> I get the nostalgic thinking about it. <laughs> I'm still looking for temp work over the holidays. I'd like to save up for my trip to Spain next year. How are things where you are? How's decorating the new apartment? Missing you lots, Emma. Oh. Missing you lots, Emma! <laughs> cool, okay, so you click everything. There's like a kind of a delay. Like, let's... Okay, there we go. So don't click, you'll leave. Wait, that's the door we came in for. Okay. So when you spawn in this game, it spawns you a little bit off the ground, so you go to <laughs> every time you enter a new area. That's awesome. Okay, another note. Dear Emma, 8th of November 2018. Things where I am are lovely. It's a lot different living in the city, and it'll take some getting used to. The pace of it, the noise, there's so much life here that I didn't know existed just from visiting. As for the apartment, interior design isn't exactly my forte. So most decisions are going through my savvier friends, savvier friends in the area before they're finalized. Okay. They have saved me from myself a few times now. How's the job hunt going? Don't forget that I love you, Justin. Aw, oh, it's so sweet. It's so sweet, Justin. All right, let's go to this bathroom. We'll send the bathroom. Any notes in the bathroom? Can I can't crouch. Um, I don't want to click because, oh, there's a note in the bathroom. Okay. Dear Emma, 6th December. I should probably look at the dates. Like, I don't know. Maybe it's telling us. I don't know. Whatever. As you read through this letter, please ensure that your internal voice is extremely nasal and congested because that's an accurate representation of the author. What? What? Is this game trying to be meta right now and tell me how to read my notes? I've had a bad cold for a couple of days and I've forgotten what it's like to be healthy. Please pray for me. This may be my last letter to you. Don't worry about the book. Just focus on your job and being home right now. I'm not going anywhere. Love, Justin. Okay, there we go. That worked, right? That was nasally. My voice is like naturally nasally because I got a big nose full of snot and... And boogers, and I know you guys wanted to hear that, but that's that's my life. Welcome to my life. You gotta embrace me for all that I am. You can't just have part of me. You have to have it all. Okay, let's go this way. And another note. Yay, note reading simulator. Dear Justin, I'm sorry that I haven't finished the book you let me at. I know I sat on that bar now, but I've been so busy. I got a job behind a bar at a local pub, and I've been doing extra shifts as much as I can. It's all, I'm also doing all my holiday assignments and helping sort out Christmas presents and decorations. I promised you that I read it by Jan I'll read it by January. I'll have read it by January. I can't read. Sorry, guys. I'm retarded. It's been so hectic. I wish we were at school again. Then I could see you every day. With love, Emma. Yay, Emma. Your voice changes a lot. Oh, wow. What kind of video game is this? An Xbox with like a old Nintendo controller? Can I play the guitar? Oh, bear. Uh, nothing else to see here. Just just an, um weird knickknacks and shit. Okay. Cool beans. Uh-huh. Okay, let's go in this room. We read another note, probably. Oh, it's a closet. With a note in it. Dear Justin, please stay attached to your Christmas gift to be open no earlier than Christmas morning. Santa didn't tell me what it is. Only that you should tell me that if A, it isn't the right fit, B, if it's perfectly C, you really like it. If it is the case that on Christmas any of those things are true, then I will relay this information to him. I hope that you're keeping warm and that you're not missing too much lots of love. Emma. Okay. Emma, your voice changes so much. It's fantastic. 
I know mine does too. It's because I'm practicing, practicing voice acting for the next big Five Nights at Freddy's game that I'm totally voice acting in. Just kidding, I'm just kidding. I'm not. 13th of December. Dear Justin, I hope that you recover from your cold. It sounded quite serious. She's writing a lot of letters without me returning them. Like, I haven't seen a letter from Justin in a little bit. You were suffering for two whole days. I only pray that you make a full recovery. If you reply to this letter, then I'll know then I'll know you still have your eyes working. You'd better be all in one piece for when I come and see you next. Being back home brings back a lot of memories. If I come and bake for for uh, with you, <laughs> okay, then you have to come back where we had our first date again. I think that's fair. Missing you, Emma. It's called Rot. So am I playing as Emma and Justin like died and he's rotting in the apartment right now? Is that what's going on? I think I think that's what's happening. Let's go through here. Oh my goodness gracious. Um so that's a lot more happening. We're losing a lot of frames now, folks. This is this is good. This is good. This is good stuff. Okay. Um so we got float and shit. Um, we got the we got a nice all in your head feels right now. Oh my god. Okay, I can't go in the closet. I don't want to go in the closet anyway. Okay, there's a kitchen. There was a note in the kitchen that I didn't read. I think. Dear Emma, I find myself wishing you could at least would at least cry. I did so much at, uh, so much work getting this to be a place where I'm happy, and you don't and you want me to leave it. It's not even finished. How can you look at this place and see something finished? How can you be so selfish from Justin? Um, okay, Justin, I think you're going a little freaky deaky here. You have to calm down a little bit. You don't need to be glitching up everything. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Let's go through this door again. All right, cool. Ooh. Oh my god. I feel like... We're on different pages. I just Is that what Emma sounds like? I just feel like I don't know. I just I don't think I can live in this place with you anymore. Oh no, Emma. The way you've changed. Oh god! Whoa! I wanted to listen to the rest of it, so she left him. When you left it was like you wanted to watch me be taken by someone else. You're lucky you leave me the kind of pain you can't take pictures of. How can you be okay letting someone else crawl around in the space we let we slept in? Oh my god. It was so easy to kill me. No hesitation. Wounds. I hate everyone watching me try to claw back into the womb. Oh my god. What was the day? What was the minute you stopped? Oh my god. <laughs> this is intense. Um... If someone comes in and changes this place, I won't know who I am anymore. This is... Wow. This is something else. B... Bed... Bedlam? Uh, okay. You are supposed to be the one to help me. Oh, what is that? Hey! Is that a heart beating? It's a heart beating. Do you think... It feels good to go out every night and pull you from... The loam again? There's so much reading. I wish you'd get sick so that you'd come back. Can't barely read this handwriting. Uh, you're watching someone die and it doesn't affect you like it does me. Oh my god. This dude's crying out for help. Uh, I never meant to make you my pornography. Oh my god. Jesus. There's someone else living here. Yeah. There's someone else living here. There's someone else living here. There's someone else living here. Someone else living here. Okay, that's all it says now. Oh my. Alright, well, this is intense. Oh! Was that him? Was that Justin? Jason? I don't remember his name. How am I supposed to remember his name? I don't care for him. My name's Emma, and I don't care for my ex boyfriend. Because that's totally what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to super care for your ex-boyfriend, like, a lot. So it's not weird at all to have that kind of mindset. That's totally not toxic at all. I mean, you care for people, yeah, but I'm not, I'm talking about, like, right. Oh, was that it? That was the game? It was good. It was a toxic-ass relationship slash breakup, though. Jesus. Is that why it's called Rod? God. 
I need Dr. Pepper now. Mmm. Dr. Pepper, sponsor JSKeybean.